Fortnite Season 10. Here are all the new Battle Pass skins for Season 10. It's 5 a.m. and me are awake, which must mean it's time for another new season of Fortnite. At the time of this writing, servers are down as we update the game for then 10th season, which Epic is calling Season 10 the theme this go around is out of time. X Lord. What if Rust Lord was way sexier? Maybe in a punk band? This seems to be the question that Epic Games asked itself before bringing Rust Lord back, and what they got was this shirtless dude swinging dual pickaxes. He starts off with a pretty lame. Catalyst. Your other starting skin this season, Catalyst is actually female Drift, who we saw in one of the preseason teasers. Like Drift, she starts off as a sort of generic 20-something, but she starts to come into her own once she gets the iconic Kitsune. Tilted Technique. Similar to Rust Lord, graffiti artist Technique already had a sort of punk style when she showed up in Season 4. That's dialed way up now, with a sleeveless tee, some tattoos, some wild blue hair, paint-stained pants, and some black sneakers. Yon 3R. DJs like Marshmallow make their names on basically never taking off their iconic helmets, but that doesn't seem to be DJ Yonder's style. In his new variation he starts off with a striking LED jacket over a black suit to kick his whole thing to a much. That's dialed way up now, with a sleeveless tee, some tattoos, some wild blue hair, paint-stained pants and some black sneakers. Technique was a real straightforward skin when she was first unveiled, even if she did become something of a sex symbol. Sparkle Supreme. Is this an old skin? I am not sure. I feel like it is but I can't quite place it. Regardless, Sparkle Supreme's whole thing seems to be classy disco, with an overall theme that seems more like Season 9's futurism more than anything else. The Ultima Knight. This guy is brand new, and this guy is something. Something like a combination of Ruin and the Ice King, Ultima Knight is a big hulking beast of tier 100 skin that seems to prefer swinging around one giant hammer. He's beefy enough that he